and then i did this small uh, three month like crash course in uh, like basics of sound engineering somewhere here locally only hmm. that really opened up i really like thank that teacher like for i mean i think it kind of changed my direction of it kind of got me clarity ki okay by the time i graduated i knew okay this is really interesting and one way to kind of uh, bring those two worlds of film and music both of which i love together was film score so uh, this is something so yeah then i, I took a break year after college i took one year uh, because i obviously had to apply for university it's not so, easy to get so the, the bmm course was like a bachelor of mass media just for people that are not familiar yes. with it you know okay and, and yes. you learn yes. about you know journalism and filmmaking <clears throat> and a bunch of different mass media related things right? yeah yeah sorry okay yeah. yeah sorry go ahead and i guess that those three years were also great in terms of the people i met uh like you and a lot of others uh yeah but like you i mean you can agree that the kind of people we had around like the kind of exposure we got i guess it was very practical like we did so many projects where so that was one thing where so i remember because we used to do so many projects where we had to shoot film like some short film or whatever documentary i was one of the there were few guys who could like so everybody used to come to me ki ye sound ka karke dena kuch yeah please uh, clean this ka sound can you please do some music for this or whatever i was in the group i could do it i used to do that so that used to be my role at, in all most of the projects to do the sound of it so that also got me into uh, all of these things led up to being okay then i thought ki, okay i can do this seriously as well. of course it was not a easy decision uh, there's so much uncertainty uh, you know where this could go so oh, after that i applied i went to mi in uh, los angeles it's a very uh, it's a very big school i mean uh, ehsan nurani it is from shankar ehsan law has also studied from there so i had known about that school and i had a great set of faculty i mean i was very lucky to have such so great so you actually so you went to the us and you it was it a yeah. in person course and how long yeah. what was it, like what was the structure of the course real what did you learn over there So I was there for a year. I was studying in Los Angeles in the in person. Everything this was around 2016 fall, uh, and uh, the course was called uh, Keyboard Technology. So it was it was more focused towards live. So the school itself is known for a lot of uh, live musicians, like more contemporary music. Whereas Berkeley School of Music, which is very popular again in Boston, is more of a conservatory kind of school where they are. uh more of classical uh, musicians coming out from there but am i is known for very good like contemporary musicians uh so yeah my i uh, there i had an elective actually for film scoring um which kind of got me towards more into the so initially as they were going to become a music producer okay i was learning there we had a different modules of softwares that we have to use um music theory even playing live with different people i'd got to play with such amazing people because uh, los angeles is a place where like how in mumbai the everybody wants to work in like the film industry comes to bombay right so la it's like at a global stage everybody in the world who wants to come work in music or film they come there so i mean i had a band where one person was from brazil the bass player was from russia then we had two uh different who for someone from sweden and these are the best of the best from those countries right because if you're spending so much money coming there to most of the times these people are serious about what they want to do they are really passionate about what they want to do all of them have their stories of how they reached at that one point so that was pretty nice to have i guess that matters like it's not just what you learn in class Uh, definitely, that really shaped me, like as a musician. The kind of people I got to just be around and play, like just learn from them, like just playing with them. Like every day, we had to play with twenty different musicians. Like as a part of the curriculum, we had to play live performances. So even though I'm a studio musician now, I'm not a live musician, but that really, really helped me, like get a lot of uh, experience. 